well, hey, this is pretty, some, you know, some of it is, there's different levels so, uh, of learners here, so <coughs> we'll try to go through some basic things. I know John, like he just, he talked about, uh, just kind of filling me in on what he said, and just to add to that, you know, um, for me on a personal level, language is something that, that uh, helps explain my world. You know, it's our world as Ani people. You know, we're only 150 years really removed from just like full blown stuff all this folk. Just it's only like four generations if you think about it. Mm -hmm. You know, and just in that that time period, you know, we're down to like a handful of speakers. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. like fingers, a couple fingers left is all. Mm -hmm. And we just got to hold on to the best that we can do and do the best we can. But at the same time. There's stuff that's been somehow, some way, people have done stuff and they've left everything for us. Hmm. You know, it's kind of like it, I, I, I equate it to like, you know, like uh, our sweat lodges. Somehow, some way, there's always been someone that kept the sweat lodge going. Yeah. You know what I mean? Or 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 there a pipe. You know, those basic things. And it's the same way with our language. Somehow, some way. You know, there's been a few that have kept it kind of going. And I, like Bo was in one of my classes at the college this year, and it's a rocking class, isn't it? There's pretty some, good. Pretty yeah. good, man. There's some people in there that can talk. Wow. I mean, I mean and, and, and it's because of the way I look. I mean, for me this year, I mean, it was really, really fulfilling just doing this stuff for like 20 years now. It's been like 20 years since I've been working on this stuff. I mean, yeah. And it's really fulfilling to go in there and, and a lot of them have, can say hello, how are you doing, you know? Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, it really made me feel good, you know? Or, or like, to me, one of the biggest things was when the college changed their name to mm -hmm. Aani Nakoda mm -hmm. from a perception wise we chose to use our traditional names. And now it's becoming part of the vernacular of our people, you know. They use that word now. They might just talk about the college that way, but they know that word now, you know. Mm -hmm. And so there's like, you know, it's like baby steps, but it's, it's there, you know. And so for me, that's why I'm so passionate about this, why I always, Every day I try to learn something new, a new word, you know, something new that, that, and, you know, if you think about it, you learn a word a day and you really learn it good, that's 365 words you could learn in a year. This mm -hmm. class, this class, as we go through it, I encourage you to be here as much as you can. I know we all have different things and, and you can't always make them all, but over the course of the year, we should be able to get a pretty good form. And, and I think the biggest thing that, that always needs to be addressed is our historical trauma in all of us. It's a, it's a hard thing to overcome. I mean, it is. It's embedded in us. And I'm not making excuses or anything, but when I still feel it when I get up, like at ceremony or whatever, I get up and I'm talking to them. And there might not be maybe one or two people that would understand what I'm saying. I still feel like Teresa Lambel's sitting there saying, you know, no, like this, or Elmer's, no. I mean, that's a trauma that's in us. And we have to overcome that. That's the biggest hurdle. That's the biggest hurdle. I mean, that is the biggest hurdle. Because we've all heard that someone say, oh boy, they say, <laughs> uh, you might say something and you're saying something really bad. Mm -hmm. And we've all, I mean, I've done it. I, I, I've done it. I've sit with this grandma for years. And I can remember one time I was saying something and she couldn't hear me. And I, I know what I said and I said it, but she couldn't hear me. But she, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> and I said, that, you know, you know, it's just not how it happened. Because... You know, but I know what I said. I know I got it right. I'm pretty darn, 99.9%. .9%, but she just didn't hear me. But that one word was so close to the other word. That's what she heard. And, but we laugh, you know. And, and 
And so <laughs> those types of things, that's why I want to, you know, I really want to stress that. Don't, I told my class, I use this adage in my classes. It's like our ancestors would take a rock. And they would take that rock, and it might be rough, it might be round, it might be, and they gotta make an arrow point out of it. Because that arrow point will feed them. Mm -hmm. And painstakingly, they chip at that rock to make an arrow point until it's functional and they can use it to feed themselves. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. And that's how I kind of, you know, parallel it. It's like that. And even sometimes you might get right to the point where it's almost ready. And you hit it and you bust off the tip and you gotta put it down, you gotta grab another rock and do it again. That's how language is. It takes a lot, a lot of work, a lot of practice to speak the language. It's just, I mean, this is, I hope to give you the foundation of this class. But what I really encourage you is to take that time to do it in your home, on your own. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. Whether it's like, as you learn things, start taping them up on the, you know, refrigerator, you know, cupboard, door, bathroom, chair, you know, because, you know, you, light, you know, all these things, you start putting them up there, then pretty soon, you know, it becomes second nature and you use that word before you know it, you use it, you subconsciously choose to speak the language as opposed to English. And that's one of the cool things that, I mean, I, I used to call my grandma Madeline and she'd always answer the phone, ah, yo. That's what she'd answer the phone, ah, yo. It's very simple, straightforward, ah, yo, what? But I can remember one time I called, I answered the phone, ah, yo, and I didn't even think about it, but <laughs> I felt good because I chose to speak our language, our God-given language. You know, it's ours. And, and so that, that, that part of it, it's really important. As a grandmother, I mean, here's an example. As a grandmother, you know, these are the issues that you have. It's like, uh, I'm the grandmother. I'm supposed to know these things. <laughs> you, you see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But yet your, your mom spoke, your parents mm -hmm. spoke. But they went through such a traumatic thing in boarding school. They did. They loved you. Mm -hmm. They loved you. That's true. And they didn't want, they didn't want you to go, to go through, through what they did. did. So they didn't speak to you out of love. That's how mm -hmm. compassion our people are. Yeah. And so, as a grandmother, you kind of have to consciously realize, hey, I might not know these things, but that doesn't mean I can't model them and try to do them for my grandchildren, to show them. You see what I mean? Mm -hmm. And not worry so much, like, because, oh, I mean, because, I, 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 you know, that's, all, that's some of the dynamics that we face, you see? You know, and and that's those things. I think you really got to address those things, those issues about learning language. Because if you don't face them individually as an individual, head on, mm -hmm. and realize that hey, I'm going to say something, and everyone's going to laugh. And I, it took me a long time. Even that, I would speak, and people would laugh. And I used to be in, in our our insecurities. Mm -hmm. Those we would think, oh my God, they're laughing about me. But nine times out of ten, with elders. When I try to speak, I might have said it. I might have said it a little bit goofy, and they might have chuckled. Mm -hmm. But they felt good because someone was speaking in it. That's the part that I didn't understand for so long. That it wasn't they were laughing at me. They were laughing because it makes them feel good. Mm -hmm. And that's 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 where we kind of gotta realize that. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And so, and you know, will I correct you guys? Yeah. But that's okay. Mm -hmm. What I'm doing is modeling it and saying that word over and over and over and over and over. And that's where like we have those things on the on on the website where you can listen to stuff over and over and over and over and over and over. Mm -hmm. That's the nice thing about it. So that those are just a couple of things that I wanted to talk to you guys about today. I know some of you guys are interested in, in possibly getting their class sevens. Okay? And so that's good too. Some of us just want to learn. That's good too. So, so sometimes I might jump to a level when one learner's here and another's here, and that's okay. All right. So, um, like I said, the first thing is our, our general greetings. You know, greeting one another, and and uh, 
and it's real simple, like I said. And I'll write stuff, and I'm not gonna take take much time, you know. But I'm gonna write it. And the reason I write it this way for those that are just learning, and it's learning a new, learning a new form of reading. But it's it's basically writing the same as like English, but it's understanding what those sounds say. So man says what? Hey, or hello. A woman says na, ha. Okay? I put those marks there because I say that syllable a little bit louder than that syllable. Well, hey, na, ha. That's hello. Very simple. Now, these are just basic stuff. Robin's heard this in my class <laughs> millions of times. So I encourage you guys to be a little bit big. Patient that way. So, what? Uh huh. Eat the wound and raid. Uh huh. Eat the wound and uh huh. 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 So he, he told her, Nahab. Nahab. This means younger brother or sister. Younger sibling. I'm just going to put that. Younger sibling. Okay? But if I say, Nah. Fahat, that's older brother. Okay? Alright? Eta one ea na ha. Ah. Eta one ea na ha neat eye. Neat eye. Neat eye. Say neat eye. Eta one ea. Eta one ea na ha neat eye. Hello, my relatives. You see what I mean? Neat I, my relative. Okay? So neat I. This backward C and I says I. Okay? The E and the I say A. The A says A. The E, the I, I say E. And this says I. Not that. She's my relative. In the way, she's my Nahab. See, my younger sister. You see what I mean? Because, see, that's how, like, in our clan system, you see, when you go out like that, your 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 younger sister, you see? Okay, so he does and he done. A couple words that are really important. So that I'll use a lot. He <coughs> da sin he da. How do they say it? Oh, you say that word. Mm -hmm. How do they say it? Eat toss and heat them. Okay? Eat toss and heat them. And this is what I like about our language. Humility is embedded in it. I'm not saying how do you say it in English. How do you say hello? <laughs> how do you say hello? Brother. You notice how in English culturally we'll say how do you say it? But in Aani we don't. We refer to our former generations, the people before us. How do they say it? Because, you see what I mean? I wasn't there in the beginning, you know what I mean? We start talking. See, that, that's the kind of stuff that, that we were missing in our own culture sometimes. That, that worldly view, you see what I mean? Okay? So, ita sanhitan, man's way hello. Wahe, nehit. Wahe, nehit. another word, I'm going to use tons, you hear it all the time. Nehit. Say it. Command. Nehit. Nehits, what hey? Nehits, naha. Nehits, naha. Nehits, naha. 
Nee, it's nicht ein. That's what does that one mean? Nicht ein means what? My relative. My cousin. 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 Yeah, cousin. All right. And so, eat das and eat down my relative. Nicht ein. Eat das and eat down my older brother. Nah, that. Eat das and eat down my younger brother or sister. Nahab. 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 Hear it? Yeah. Hear it? Nahab. Okay? Just say Nahab and you'll be alright. And we'll fine tune it as we get going. Nahab. Ah. So, basic greeting, you know, and, uh, John talked, he said he talked about saying, there's all different kinds of ways to say something. I might say, like I asked Rob when she came in, I said, hey, Don, soon, Nikki. She said, nee, Nikki, no, I'm good. I said, how is your life? She said, my life is good. Now, I could say, how you doing? Yeah, how you doing? See, she said, I knew what she said though. Mm -hmm. Good. See, now, I could just say good too. Yeah, I just say, nee, good. Okay? But there's different forms of speaking. I could say, nee, nikki, instead of nee, nikki, no. Because you asked me the question, and I don't need to put I on there, because you know you're asking me, so I don't have to be so formal and say I on the end of the word by saying, because nee, nikki, no. The no on the end of the word means I. But since you asked me, I'm just saying, oh, I'm good. See? As opposed to saying, good. See? So that, that, that. So when we ask that, we could say, here's the difference. You say, a dozen, Nikki, a dozen, Nikki. A, oh my goodness, I don't know, maybe this will work here. Yeah. So we could say, for example, a, a means you, dos means how, or what? Etasiniki. In now, iniki means life. Life. How. You. See what I mean? See the order and the way we say things is different. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that's another thing you got to think about. It was like that in our class. Remember I said, it want, kill, he, him. <laughs> that's how it sounds. If I was, or no. He wanted to, he wanted to kill him. Like we're talking about the story about they was a weasel horse wanting to kill this elk. But that word, you see in the order, that's how it would come out of us to verbatim. It'd be, it want, kill, he, him. In English? In English, yeah. See, and that's what we got to remember is English is our borrowed language. Ma'ani is our itawu, and our real genuine language. Okay, so, so etasuniki, basic thing. How how is your life? You see what I mean? So it, it translates out to how is your life? How are you? It mean how are you? How is your life? My pen's going. It's not good. But my pen's not. How is your life? Basic, you know, how is your life? How are you? How are you doing? See all those different ways we say stuff? Etasuniki. 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 Talk to me, it's etasuniki. Ah, ni iniki. Now I'm replying. Ni meaning good. Iniki. Iniki meaning life. And na meaning I. So good life I am having, basically. You see what I mean? It means I'm having a good life. Just showing you the order. So. Ni iniki na. Nach 
Nachtenen, Nachtenen, Ahab. Say an Ahab. Nachtenen or Nachtenen Athah. Eitasen. You know, Grandpa Joe was here telling a story, and I remember my name was in that story. Oh. I recognized it. Nee, 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 nee,
How are you doing? Say it. Nihits. Now, if I put this in the front of it, in heat, say it again. Okay? Alright? Okay? So, now, we learned some base introductions. But the biggest, the main word I just started with today, it's the most important word in our language. criticism mm -hmm. I'm, I'm, you know that's what I would take you know he, and he was good for it you know so I loved about him I mean <laughs> you know honest though I did thought no he was a straight shooter as far as I always thought of him sure miss him boy white clay our word is derived from this word right here people as a body of people omni nen you know like Teresa you know, would always say that omni nen okay omni -nen. But, but this if you break this out by itself it's inen but aok what's the one what's the one me ah. said what's the one right what's the one Bob and you sir what's the one what the matter it what's the one ayo hey talk yeah So that's when we use that, where we say "oni" then is more like "that's who I am." Okay, I can still say that too. I can say "ni nano oni," I am white clay. But I also could say "ni nano oni then," and I could say "oni ni no." I'm white clay that way too. So there's all these different ways to say stuff, but we'll keep it pretty basic. I just want to stick with this one. Uh, oh, nee, nah. well, hey, well, hey, man. Oh, nee, no, nah, man. Suck the hearts, man. Uh, cannot sit. Cannot sit. Got Indian name, Sid? Yeah, Horse Guard. Horse Guard? Guard it. 
Like you, it's a guard. Okay, at me hop. What's a guard? What's hop? What's at me? Ma on me. At me. Me pony. Ah, it was hop at me. That's my part of my grandson's or name too. It was hop at me hop. That's how I'd say. I want the guards over. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh wow. So. It doesn't hit on hello man's way. Why? Why? It doesn't hit on. It doesn't hit on woman's way. Nah. Ah. Nah. 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 Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, the T eight, the theta says. Okay, so if I wrote this right here, watch this in the boat. You better know what to do. Right. <laughs> Say it. Niti. What's niti mean? My friend. See, I don't say niti. I say niti. <laughs> Okay? Because not nah, that. <laughs> so that's always, that's a good, great question because yeah. I didn't explain that. Mm -hmm. See, so now you know. Okay? So this one is neck. 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 Anybody know that one? Neck. It's a kinship term. Neck. Neck. My older sister. Mm -hmm. Neck. Sister. Nahab, my younger brother or sister. Nahab. 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 My older brother. Neat I. Neat I. My relative. Neat T. Neat T. My friend. My friend. My partner. My homie. See my grandma then. My homie. Neat T. Neat is my friend. Neat Neat Be lazy, be rolling around in the chair. I said he would have that wheel. I thought they. Neat My friend. Now, this is a way that women would say, and men can say it too, a man would say me T to a woman. A woman in general, it's just in general, there's other terms. A woman would say to a woman, me T, but a man to a man would say ba. 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 You see? So I would say, ba on hey, wa hey ba. Wa hey. Wa hey ba. Hello partner. Hello my friend. Woos. <laughs> ah, wa hey me T. Oh hey, go on. Oh hey, Niti. Hey, the moon and uh, hey, the moon and woos. Nah, Niti. Nah, Niti. Hey, the moon and uh, it was hot at me. At me, ha. Nah, Niti. Hey, the moon. Nah, Niti. Nah, Niti. What's up? What's up? Hey, oh, he kept. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, hey, ba. Oh, hey, ba. Eight wa, eight the moon ba on day, wa hey ba. And he can't say ba. <laughs> okay, can't say ba. I was telling him about, uh, what was that teacher's name? He used to teach here, Bruce, uh, Bradway. Bruce Bradway. You guys know Bruce Bradway? Yeah. He used to yeah. teach, and he'd say, How do you say friend? <laughs> I'd say, Wa hey ba. Okay, I got it. Wa hey ba. <laughs> <laughs> and ba means poop and grow up. <laughs> say, no. Back. <laughs> That's what it means. Literally, it does. So, way back. So back. <laughs> Not back. <laughs> back. <laughs> and you, say, always, you hear this on the radio. If you're just the KGBA, Tony always says it. Way back. You know, always say, you know, way back. This is the KGBA. <laughs> you know, oh mm -hmm. partner, you say, oh my. So that also means my friend, but only men in the way. Okay. So it doesn't mean how are you? 
Men, inenik, inenik, men, I'm saying, I'm calling out to you guys. Inenik, itasin hitan, I'm living well. Ninichi. Ninichi. Ah, ninichi. 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 Ah, what is it? Itasin hitan, how are you? Yeah. I'm living well. Because see, there's good right there. See, ni i. And I put ni there just by itself. Okay? White clay person. Aani nen. 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 Aani nen. How do you just say white clay in general? Aani. 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 We draw it out. See, that's that's an example. See, we, we say it fast now. Aani. But it's aani. It's drawn out on the end like that. Pretty me, short man, gave me the best advice ever. She said, I understand everything you're saying, but Grovan is a slowly spoken language. Take your time. And I took that to her. Yeah. You can think about it today. We're, we're, we're all, you know, we got to be here. 6.30. We're done at 7.30. You know, we'll go to work at 8. Hurry up! 7.55! You know what I mean? We're on that clock nowadays. And I think it affects even our language when we speak sometimes. So, alright. So, these are some basic things, okay? Alright. We'll switch up. How are, we, how are we doing? Let's see here. Let's see. Let's just switch up. Because this guy can help. This will help him in his class. But these are some basic things. Okay? Yeah, grab your sheet. We're not going to do that story. Don't worry about that, boy. <laughs> we'll put some pictures out. What the ninna on? What the ninna? What the ninna on? Pictures. Ah. What the ninna on? What the ninna on? What the ninna on? Does anybody know this view? Ah, uh, uh, McCann. Oh, no. R. C or C. That's McCann view. McCann. 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 Oh. Yeah. We call it Aasiya. Aasiya. It's out on the end. You guys know where this is? Aasiya. It's that one little view as you're going out. As you're going out to Hage, you look over to the bear paws, it's that one way on the end. That one closest to us. Yeah. yeah. It's a holy mount to our people. This is one of those buttes, uh, I think Bullage went fast and all. Oh, okay. Okay. Does he slap like pits over there too? Yeah, there's still like pits there. Yeah. There's fasting pits there. There's quite a few places. Mm -hmm. You can go all over the mountains and find them. But this is just, <clears throat> that's just this view. But for this, we're going to use it just as a view. Kya atiya. Kya All right. Now I'm going to put some food out here. I'll bring some pictures and we'll just kind of, but, uh, and we'll put some food out here. Like this. Okay. Dry meat. A little bit of ginger here, yeah. Dry meat. It's a house, a couple animals here. Okay? He's out of the way. Now, for for the, the people that are pretty new to this language and are just learning about it, one of the things that we always have to do is what? We have to look at something and we have to decide. A little review here. I'm sure it's at you, Robin. A little review. We look at something and we have to decide one of two things. What is it? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Bo? If it's alive or not. If it's alive or dead. Mm. Whether it's animate or inanimate. Or inanimate. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay. So, we look at these things. Okay. So, Oxy and Nikki. Is it living? Yes. Ah, 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 
Se è se nikki. Se nikki. Se. Se means what? No. Ah no. means what? Yes. Se. Yes. Let's go to it. Se. Se. Ah. Ah. Se. Se. Ah. Se. Ah. Se. Ah. Ah. Se. Ah. Se. Ah. Ah. Okay. Se iniki. Se iniki. Ni iniki. Ni iniki. Ah, se iniki. Se iniki. Se iniki. Ah, ah, se iniki. Se iniki. Ah, no se wajana. Se no se wajana. Se wajana sits. Ah, se iniki. Se iniki. Se wajana sits. It's a iniki. Be e be e. Ni iniki. I was a ni iniki. Aka ut se iniki. Kya ati ya? Se iniki. Bayetho. Bayetho. Se iniki. Se wakya natsits. Se iniki. He doesn't eat on bread. Kyatsa. 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 Se iniki kyatsa. Se iniki. Se iniki. Ah. Pescata. Pescata. No, it's pescata. Pescata. Ah. Pescata. Atsin iniki. Se iniki. Ah. 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 Ah, 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 I was Fred used to say the was because bear means was. You have was for an elk, I was for a horse. I was means like a male animal. It means like beast, like he used to say. Mm. He said, I think it means like a beast, oh, yeah. some sort of big beast. So that, that was part of it. Mm. And linguists say it means a dog, but it, to me it's not a dog. The dog doesn't have anything to do with plus. <laughs> you know? So, it was a. 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 Be be I was a ni iniki. Ah, be ehi. Ate iniki. Ah, be ehi. Ni iniki. Ah, a iniki. Ah, a iniki. Iniki. No, ni iniki. Tate ni. Ah, wow. Be ehi. I was a. Be ehi. Ah. Now, Nate. Da. Da. T starts like a T, ends like a D. Uh, so we say da. 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 So. Da. 
da 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 means where is he or she? You see what I mean? Which one? Now, we look at things and we have to define what about any kind of object? Animate or inanimate. So out of all these things, which ones are animate and which ones are inanimate? Only two animate. And the rest are inanimate, right? Okay. Let's move these off to the side here. No. Akaot, Gyatiya, Bayitho, Gyatsa, Beskata, Aan. Say Wachyanats. Say Wachyanats. Say Say Wachyanats. Ah. So, I'm going to ask you which one? Where is it? Okay. That, that. Okay. So if we, so if I, let's do this in English. Uh, and you got to verbalize it. You can just point. I know you can just point, cat, But you're going to verbalize it and tell me, okay? So I say, where's the elk? Tell me. Ellie, yeah, yeah. It's over there. She said, okay. Where's the deer? Right, it's right here. <laughs> okay. Where's the elk? Right there. Right there. Where's the deer? Right there. It's right there. Oh, so it's still not. See how some said it's right here and it's right there? It's over there? So I didn't invade your space yet. You see what I mean? You see what I'm saying? Because once it got so close, you're going to say it's right here, right? Yeah. Now, okay, where's the elk? Over there. Where's the deer? Right here. <laughs> now, do you notice how she differentiated mm -hmm. based on location? Mm -hmm. That's an important concept. See, that's stuff that we talk about in, lang in our English language, we don't even think about. I mean, we just do it. Oh, it's right here. You see, and as I moved it around everyone, see, I went to Bo. Oh, it's right here, he said. Mm -hmm. It's in his world, man. It's elk. It's right here. <laughs> I went to Robin, and she's like, oh, it's over there. You know, and I'm, it's over there. It's over there. It's over there. It's over there. You know, cat. You see what I mean? So, so, now, that's something to remember. Okay? So, I'm going to erase all this stuff, and I'm just going to talk about those ones right there. So that, that means, where yeah. is it? Where is it something animate? Where is he or she, right? Uh, Have we got, got that? Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay, so we're talking only about animate stuff. So I would say, for example, if it's right here, I would say, yeah. Oh, oh. I would say, Ina. 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 It's right here. But if I say, Nana, I'm saying it's over there. You see what I mean? Okay? That's literally. But now, when we think about this also, okay? They could be both right next to each other. And you notice how everyone kind of described, decided where if it was, in, it was over there or here. Mm -hmm. So if they're right next to each other, now it could be in a horizontal plane too, right? Mm -hmm. I could say, oh, it's over there, because I'm saying the right side is closer to me. Proximity is very important. Mm -hmm. Okay? So, so if you think it's, it's right here, whether it's, it doesn't matter, you can still just say, oh, in that bit. Ina was Or I could say, oh nana behe. Nana it was. Okay? That that be ehe. That that Ina. Ina. Well you got a point to it. Ina be. Ah, that that it was. Ina it was. Ah. That that be ehe. Tata Iwasu. Na. Wait, what is it? Na na. Na na. 
is different you use dog but when you want to know where something is or which one something is mm. you'll say that that only if it's what alive, alive mm. or inanimate no inanimate huh? animate. 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 now what does animate mean it's alive or it what moves, moves. so in grove on if I had a basketball it's considered animate a car is considered animate the moon, the sun is considered animate. A belt is considered animate. A door is considered animate. There's a lot of these kind of weird stuff that we don't think. Now a tree is inanimate. But it's alive. Yeah. Yes, yes. It's a philosophical. <laughs> I understand. See, that's what's kind of weird, you know. In our Indian way, you know, we say, oh, yeah, everything has a spirit, you know, and it's true. But the way we describe things, sometimes we describe it as inanimate in nature. But the spirit of that tree, now we do it that way. See what I mean? See that? Okay. So now, 
So we learned about animate and inanimate so far, right? But really we just learned about which one again? Animate. Animate. Now I'm gonna learn about inanimate. And I'm saying When a word ends with a hyphen like that, it's called a glottal stomp. So I'd say da da. So I open my it's like da da. Yeah. We cut our breath off. Okay? Dot do. So if this that that means which one is he or she, dot do means which one or where is it, right? Where is it? Where is it? And this again, when I mean it, I'm saying inanimate. See, I should put he, I should change this to he or she. And that's another thing. Okay? We all can look around the room and know who's a male and a female in this room. So we don't, we don't use a he or she in our language. We just, we use shim. Okay? All right? So for this case, it is always gonna be inanimate. Okay? He or she is, we use it. You notice that with animals? We use, we'll use it for an animal. So in English, it can mean something animate as well as something inanimate, okay? But in Ani, it's not good to use it as something inanimate, or animate, excuse me, only inanimate, okay? So we say, Dato, where is it? Which one is it, okay? So if it's right, now again, we're talking location, right? We're moving stuff around. Now I'm gonna say, E what? E yo, yeah, not E U. E yo, because the O and the U always say O, O, O. So now I'm saying it's what? Right here. So what tells us it is here? What means here in both of these? E. E. And the na means what then? We're talking about something that is, and the yo means that we're talking about something. Because the O means it, and the A means he or she, like, yeah, animate. Ah. Ah. It is right a hole like that. here, a hole that way. Ah, that way. Oh. Yeah. Ah. All right, so now, <laughs> let's think about this now. If I have E, yo, what do you think I'm going to say right here? Nah, yo. Nah, yo. And so that means it's right <laughs> there. It's right there. Nah, yo. Nah, yo. Nah, yo. He doesn't. He done an elk. He was. He doesn't. He done a deer. Good. Ah, no hot dog. Bad yes though. 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 This can mean a house. Can mean a fort. Can mean a cabin. Okay, building. Depending on you know how, but mostly a house. Okay, bad yes though. Long ago, this would be a fort. Because that was, you know, people love that. Bayisto. Eat us and eat on house? Bayisto. Eat us and eat on house? Bayisto. Bayisto. Eat us back to the hat. Eat us back to the hat. Ah. I said, how do you what? Talk with your hands with it. Bayisto. Ah. 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 Ah, ah, you know, like taking that meat, you know? Butterfly it out. Ah, ah. Not a pro at it, believe me. Ah, ah. 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 
Dracto Bayiso. Everyone, it should be because it's all away from us. So, Nayo, Nayo Bayiso. Ah, Toto Aan. Nayo Aan. Ah, Ikya Aan. Toto, Toto Aan. Ah, Toto Bayiso. Ah, Toto Aan. Ah, Tata Iwasu. Ah, why? Tata be Ah, Tata Aan. Tato Aan. Say Tata. Tato Aan. Nee. Nee. Ah, eat toss and eat on deer? Be he. Eat toss and eat on elk? It was. It was. Ah. Ah, well, hey. Woos. Ah, tato. Tato by you, though. Ah, tato. Tato or am. Ah, it doesn't hit on house. It doesn't hit on dry meat. It doesn't hit on beef jerky. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> ah, tato by yeso. Nah, nah yo. By yeso. By yeso. By yeso. Ah, Toto or An? Nayo. Ah, Nayo? Wait, E. Yo. Well, you can say Nayo. Yeah. Wait, no. Eo. Eo. Tata, it was, sir. Nayo. Nayo, it was, sir. Wait, Nana, it was, sir. He was the Atsi Iniki. Ah, he was the Ni Iniki. Ah, Bayetho Atsi Iniki. Ah, Nana, he was the Nayo Bayetho. Tata, he was the Ah, Nana, wait, Nayo. It was sick. Ah, ne. Tata, tata be Ah, nana be. Ah, tata or an. Ah, tata by Or tato by Ah, tata it was yeah, ah, well, hey, well, hey, ah, oh, not Gavin, ah, oh, 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 doctor, oh, ah, oh, ah, ah, doctor, by you, oh, hey, ah, doctor. Toto, Toto, by you so. Ah, Tata, it was so. Tata, it was so. Ah, Tata, be it. Ah, it doesn't hit on elk. It was so. It doesn't hit on. Be it. It doesn't hit on. Ah, it doesn't hit on. Oh, and oh, and oh, no, 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 no,
Gatsa. Ah, it's then it needs Gatsa. Gatsa. Well, hey, he doesn't eat on bread. He doesn't eat on a loaf. Ah, all right. Ya atiya. Ya. Ya atiya. Wait, ya atiya. Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Nihit. Ya atiya. Ya. Ya. Inanik nihit. Ya. Inan if that. Ya. Ya atiya. Say it, ya. Ya atiya. Ya. 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 Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Ya Ya. 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 That means it's round. You see what I mean? Because we're talking about the butte and the bread. Even the bread's that way. You see what I mean? So we're saying it's rounded. You see? That's what that means. Okay. Tato ya atiya. Tato ya atiya. Say ya sa. Ya atiya. Ya atiya. Nina ya atiya. Nina ya sa. Tato ya atiya. Yeah, nice. Yo. Yo. Ya atiya. Tato Gatsa. Gatsa. Yo. Say it. Yo. Nayo. Nayo. Gatsa. Wahe. Wahe. Ba. Ba. Tato Gatsa. Nayo Gatsa. Tato Gatia. Yo. Gatia. Ah. Ika. Gatia. Tato. Tato on. 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 Na na yo ah wait I won't pick on you no more. Ah, tato gyatsa. Na yo gyatsa. Ah, tato gyatsa. Yo gyatsa. Ah. Wow. He's just there. Tato gyatsa. Ah, Tato Gatia. Yo. Nee. Nee. Ah, what's your Indian name? Nakatiehi be woke nesha. Nakatiehi, okay, eagle be woke, crying. Crying. What was the last part? Crying eagle. Crying, oh, it's that, okay. Nakatiehi be woke, it's that, right? Why, hey. Ah, Ninanik, Nakatiehi be woke, it's that. Ah, it's a woman in the hat. It's not her. Ah, it's a woman in the hat. 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 Ah, it's a Say, oh. <laughs> I don't know. Thunderbird or thunder. Oh. Eekya ah. Nee. Eekya ah. And he said, Eekya ah. Eekya ah. That's a uh, rising. Eekya ah. Hmm. Smudge. Smudge. Yeah. Yeah. Right? Long time I haven't. Woos. <laughs> 
Ooh, see. <laughs> she could have heard this hard cap. A lot. <laughs> you could have put like, I don't know, something cat. Ah. <laughs> you know, I, I, I try, it's kind of hard to like not think in English. I was trying to think in uh, Indian. Indian. Uh, yeah, and, and you see, that's the thing. That's the part, okay, when we go through stuff, that's what you're thinking a lot of times. Oh, he said, okay. He yeah. said, yaktaya. Okay, yaktaya means uh, food or bread. Okay, oh yeah, okay now. No, it's right there. So how do I say, now is it adamant or debt? I mean, that's the stuff we're yeah. thinking about. I have to think in seven languages before I get to grow up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because of the accent, it triggers. Because I learned all the languages I learned from full immersion. Only spoke it. Never did uh, uh, learn it by like this. But no. they spoke it in front of me, and it would stick. And I'd ask them, and they'd show me by going like this. Yeah. And even him in Gravat, when I first learned, he he just spoke it. That's it. Nice. So I learned quick. And then my grandmother too. When I was small, she used to speak only Gravat. Mm -hmm. So his accent and her accent are kind of the same, but. Uh, and then the old ladies when they talk too. And then the old men talk different. So you're like, yeah. you know? Uh, that's what they're getting at too there. I mean, you know, that's how we're trying to get them to talk man and woman, mm -hmm. you know? But as much as you hear it, if you hear it more and more and more, you can like really easily. Mm -hmm. yeah. Especially once you learn, and I, I believe this, this is one thing that the more you learn, if you learn one language, it's easier to learn another language because it's like your order, the way you put things together. Yeah you notice the differences when you're talking about stuff because you know right where like for example we use it or he mm -hmm. in one language it might be in the front the other one it might be in the middle and the other one it might be in the end and so you just hear those things yeah. and like with Nakoda you know when I hear Nakoda I pick it up pretty good because you know I know where I'm listening to where things are at I may not speak it as good mm -hmm. but understanding Nakoda I can understand it pretty yeah. good you know, tough he'll lose me sometimes, but I can stay with him. Yeah, yeah. but you hear it all the time. Yeah. That's when you can speak it. Yeah. You know? It doesn't hit on dry meat. Oh, and. Oh, and. It doesn't hit on where is it? Where is it? I heard all kinds of answers. Dato. Ah, dato. Where is he or she? Which one is it? Which one is he or she? It's oh he it's he's over there. She's over there. Shim's over there. Uh, it's right here. Bread. Yeah. Wait, <laughs> So the ah part means where. Ah can mean where or when. Okay, so what it's saying is that place, so I might say in ah that place where it's steep or high. You see what I mean? Because ja can mean high, like going upward, but it also can mean steep as in an angle. You see what I'm saying? That's how you look at things, okay? Mm. So it's just like tall, tall or long. Mm. If it's on a vertical plane, vertical plane, I would say aya, it's mm. tall. Mm. But if it's on a horizontal plane, I would say aya, it's long. But you use the same word, just the way you look at it. Mm. See what I mean? Mm -hmm. So then I would say bo's tall. You see what I mean? Hey. Hey. It's tall. Okay? Eat okay. and eat down. Akjaot, akjaot, akjaot. Excuse me, akjaot, akjaot. Akis inette akjaot. 
People. Little People's Creek Canyon. That's the real name, not Mission Canyon, but Little People's Creek, where it's steep. You see what I mean? Ah. Now there's two words to this one. I mean, there's more than that even, but <laughs> the simple way you could say ba'at. Ba'at. And ba'a. What does ba'a mean? Red. It's red, right? Okay. So in that word ba'a, okay. In that word, we say ba'a. Now I said you can call soup Ba-ots. Ba-ots. Okay? So if this means it's red, this part right here means it. So this means shirut, meaning red. So we're saying red, and this means liquid. So ba-ots. Now I can also say this too. <coughs> <coughs> ba -ow. That means a liquid too. Ba -ow. You know what that means? Liquid. Red liquid. So what can it mean? <laughs> what kind of but what color is it? Red, red. So what kind of if it's red water, what are you drinking? Wine. Wine. <laughs> okay, if I'm have, if I'm having a burger, what is what is it now? Redder wine. No, if I'm having a burger, what is it now? What? Um, rare. And I have pickles with it. Tomato. And you mix that together to make a, a, a liquid. So that ba up means really wine. That's more of a. That's what I use for ketchup too in my house. I'll say ba up. Yeah. So then I would say me nehan up. Mustard. Mustard. Because it's yellow oh, yeah. liquid. Yellow. Yeah. And Iwan Iwanuski now. Booger. <laughs> no. So that's kind of where we're at though with that, you know? Did you do this all time? We just started. Oh, today? Yes, yeah, today I did. And we're starting all winter, so okay. you can come every week. You know, to Tuesdays and Thursdays. Okay. What time is it anyway? 801, it's time. Yeah, that's it. So we learned some words. I'll keep. I'm gonna bring. What we're gonna do.